Hello and welcome back to our Let's Play of Might and Magic. So last time we finished up the uh, Magic Square puzzle in the Magic Square Cave. We got some buffs out of that, plus two intellect and just some minor experience. And so this time we're going to try and complete off uh, something that has to do with Og. So as you may know, we've seen lots of black and white rooms all around the world. Um, Apparently, in some of these rooms, there are actually um, items in them. There's two items that we need to get, and the statue that gives us a hint about that is it talks about Og's idols, or something like that, and uh, we need to get that to him, the black and white, I assume black and white idols, I could be wrong. Um, the first one is actually over in B1, and it's in the wizard's lair which we have not gone to yet but we're just going to quickly go ahead and head and teleport over or we have gone to it i'm sorry we just have not finished it yet um, i think we can do it but maybe that's for next episode or something like that so let's go ahead and teleport north um i guess nine squares or so we need to just get to the very very tip top and oh north four squares and so just to give you some relational stuff on where we are of course we're in the top part of this and we're trying to go over here to this black white room the wall is painted from ceiling to floor in a black and white checkered pattern and we search and we can actually find something and we found the black queen idol all right so um with that being done now we can go ahead and escape out let's go ahead and go south nine and we can go back up cool so for the other one the other one is in a location what we have not been to yet it's i'm not sure how we were supposed to find out about it but it's the fabled building of gold and we need to go travel to e4 and if you remember this is where i've done lots of grinding i killed lots of these demons over here there's a big peak over here, um, but also it seems like there is a building in the center of this area. So we're actually going to try and go into the building and ignore um, the encounters because they can probably kill us. I don't think the where we're headed, the building of gold, can actually uh, kill us, but who knows? It's It's possible. I feel like lots of things in this game are very exclusive you know it, it's it's odd it's like they have a uh all right well here we go the fabled building of gold enter yes uh, what i was saying is it's like they have a barrier of entry but it doesn't necessarily matter if you can just get past it so um looks like there's lots of cool things down here there's lots of different rooms uh there's lots of signs to explore and whatnot but really we're just trying to go to the black white room and uh get the ice or get the idols uh, for Og, and that can help him out. So let's go ahead and do that, and then we can return here on a later episode and complete it through. So let's go into here. All right, and let's search. Oh, nothing. Okay, so apparently there is another black and white room in this area. So let's go ahead and maybe uh, get over to the stairs. I'm not sure which staircase we actually need to, to travel. So we're going to go ahead and go through a few of them. All right, stairs going down. Take them. All right, done that. Okay, cool. It looks like we have a way to get around here. Just to show you on the map where I'm going, we took these stairs, we went down, and it looks like there's a black-white room here. So let's go ahead and uh, do that. It appears that the Building of Gold only has two levels. So uh, that shouldn't be too big of a deal. Oh, okay. All right, spell failed. Let's go ahead and cast then uh, Etherealize and go through here. There we go. The room is painted from ceiling to floor in a black and white checkered pattern. Okay, so we searched it and there is nothing here. Well, what could that necessarily mean? Are we not, did we not do something uh, correctly, right? I, I'm not sure. Oh, okay, wait a minute. Oh, I am wrong. It appears that we need to go to we need to go back up we're trying to get the level four so i was completely wrong um 
there is definitely more levels than what I thought. So we're going to have to go ahead and cast a Thoralize and a Thoralize again. We'll go back up some stairs. Maybe that can get us to like level three or something. All right. So there should be a, an invisible wall there. Yep. And there's some stairs going down. Cool. And so, yep, this takes us immediately to level four. And it looks like there is definitely uh, some black and there's a black and white room somewhere. And this map is so weird. Let me show you. This is freaky. Like there's all these little panels here. It's like it's kind of like a weird broken corridor area. So that's that's kind of odd. It looks like there's lots of dangerous stuff down here. Um, so let's. I, I don't want to necessarily skip through the encounters, but it, it seems almost as if we we want to do that and maybe. Next time we can come back. Oh, I don't think we can, actually. It's not going to let us, right? So if I cast a Thoralize, yeah, it won't let us cast through that. It knows what we're trying to do. And if I come over here on the map, if I come over here, we tried to cast it up here. I'm going to cast Teleport here. I, I think it's on to us, right? It, it knows that we don't want to... We're, we're trying to cheat the system a little bit, so yeah. All right, okay, we're going to rest here, and then we're going to cast up our spells. And uh, we're going to see if we can tackle some some bosses, I guess. Maybe they're mini-bosses. I hope it's not a big letdown, but I, I highly doubt it. Okay, blue dragon and some green dragons. A worthy challenge. Uh, let's go ahead and cast Heroism on Warlord Mal. Sylvanas, go ahead and shoot the blue dragon. And you one-shotted it, nice. We're going to go ahead and cast Power Shield. And Ferris, go ahead and attack. All right, so he's poisoned. Ah, oh, that breathes poison. Well, as long as they don't start breathing freaking gas that turns us to stone, that'll be fantastic. I'm going to go ahead and cast... Oh, I can't cast neutral, Neutralize Poison. That is interesting. So I'm going to go ahead and cast, uh, I think, Heroism just on Sylvanas, maybe. All right, and there you go. 101 damage. Nice job. Cool. I did not mean to do that, but apparently we're going right into combat again. So, um, let's go ahead and cast 4-7 uh, on Mal. And Sylvanas, go ahead and shoot the Gray Dragon. You didn't one-shot it, but that's okay. Kurgan, go ahead and cast your Power Shield. I have a feeling I'm going to be using Divine Intervention here shortly. So Spikes, looks like they're doing quite a bit of damage. 38 points. And Frost, okay. That didn't do too badly of damage. It looks like the gray dragons are kind of the bigger threat. And hey, Ferris actually killed a dragon. That's that's impressive. All right, then we killed that dragon too. Uh, go ahead and cast Divine Intervention. I think that's a that's a good idea. Sylvanas, and you one-shotted the white dragon. There we go. All right, so I, I searched. I didn't step forward. It didn't let us search. Uh, so hopefully, I think we can just go ahead and here and cast 7-2. Oh my goodness, no effect. All right. Uh, I've never seen the wear phase mummies before. Those things scare me. Let's go ahead and cast Power Shield. And uh, Ferris, go ahead and shoot the wear phase mummy. Grug, attack the wear phase mummy. Okay, all right, we got one of them down. That's good. All right. Hmm. Okay, it doesn't look like they can hurt us too badly, but man, that freaked me out. That holy word didn't work. Is it, I'm going to try again. Okay, apparently I cannot do that. That is that is discouraging. So let's go ahead and cast uh, Dancing Sword. And some of them were affected, some of them were not. <laughs> and now the man-eating mares are running away. Okay, we're going to keep attacking. Yeah, they do regenerate, I think. So that's definitely a problem. Uh, let's go ahead. Can I cast Divine Inter... I don't think I need to do that. Let's go ahead and cast uh, Superheroism on Warlord Mal. Sylvanas, go ahead and shoot him. Nice, we actually brought down someone. Dancing sword, here we go. Ferris, go ahead and shoot the mummy. Nope, nothing. Okay, Grug, attack. Mal, attack. Nice, getting him down. And uh, I'm going to just go ahead and cast Divine Intervention so we can bring everybody up. And of course, my Where We Are application has crashed. That's okay. I'll bring that up while we're fighting through some stuff. And uh, all right, let's go ahead and shoot him and attack. There we go. Cool. Awesome. All right, let me go ahead and grab the where we are. Where are we? That's that's the name of the application. Where are we application? All right, so I brought back up the mini map. Cool. Let's search. Hope we found some good stuff in here. 
Ah, nothing. All right, we're going to go ahead and rest, and then we're going to go ahead and recast our protection stack up. Seems like we're fighting some dragons down here. It doesn't seem to me that difficult, so I think definitely on the next episode, we're probably going to try to come back here. All right, I'm up. I'm going to cast Superheroism on Warlord Mal, and Sylvanas, go ahead and shoot the red dragon. We fought many red dragons before, so I'm not too worried about them, but it's still worth casting Power Shield. The Acid, ow. Okay, so they're doing some good AoE damage against us. All right, Grug, attack. Mal, attack. Nice. I'm going to go ahead and cast Superheroism again on Sylvanas. Sylvanas, go ahead and shoot. There we go. Kurgan. Um, I don't know. Let's try Prismatic White. What happens? Uh, you, you took five points. Okay. <laughs> and he ran away. All righty. Cool. So let's go ahead and back up. And there's one more encounter here. I, I wonder what we're going to be fighting. It's, I, I assume it's going to be like a bunch of super bronze dragons or diamond dragons or something like that uh, who knows right okay just some silver dragons and gold dragons we fought gold dragons before i don't think i've ever seen a silver dragon let's cast superheroism on mal sylvanas go ahead and shoot the silver dragon Kurgan, we need you to cast power shield right away and one point of damage oh my goodness what a low roll <laughs> two roll wow that is hilarious. So the silver dragon did like one point of damage on us. That's funny, but it's, and we brought one of them down. Awesome. So it looks like we're really low. So I'm probably going to have to cast divine intervention right after this. As soon as it's my next turn. Yep. I'm going to cast that and heal everybody up. Sylvanas, go ahead and shoot the silver dragon. Nice. And Kurgan, go ahead and cast a uh, dancing sword. Why not? Sarah, uh, Ferris attacks. Yeah, the gold dragon is really what does lots of the damage because it doesn't seem like his energy attacks get blocked by the, the shield that uh, Eclipse can, attack, can use. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and cast Superheroism again on Sylvanas and maybe we get like another good shot. There we go. 15,000. Woo, that is a lot of experience. So I'm going to go ahead and step forward. The wall is painted in a black and white checkered pattern. All right. Cool. We found the white queen idol. So it's queen idols. What's the deal with the queen? Um, I, I don't know. I'm just going to cast surface and take us back up. And of course, I'm going to go ahead and cast um, back to C2. Go home to Sorpagal. And save our game. And then we'll go to Og. And... We'll see what he is. Um, I do wonder, why is it the queen idols? I, I don't exactly understand. Get out of our way, vampire bats. Oh my gosh, you, you have a death wish if you're trying to approach us. Um, it's just kind of weird, right? So anyways, let's go and cast fly to d4. And we will head down to Mr. Og himself. Painted on these grounds is a black and white checkered motif covered with idols similar to the ones you oh <laughs> similar to the ones you carry. A large being approaches, Og speaks. Queen to Queens level three. Okay, so it's a giant pun on like three-dimensional chess, right? Is this it really? This is the big joke. <laughs> um is this from Star Trek or Star Wars? Um, so one second, I'm going to, yeah, I'm going to leave a little bit of a pause here. So go ahead and think up your response. I know where I'm searching. I, I know there's like a pop culture reference or something like that. Maybe this is, this is it. I'm kind of disappointed if it really is going to be that. Um, so let me go check what the dialogue actually is in Star Wars or Star Trek or something like that. So one second. Okay, and uh, you haven't thought about your answer and you want to continue your research and thinking about it, uh, so go ahead and pause the video here. So, I was right. It was definitely a Star Trek reference. I thought it could have been a Star Wars thing because I tried to look up Star Wars first and I couldn't find it. Uh, Star Wars doesn't have 3D chess. It actually has holographic chess. 
uh, or hologram chess or whatever you'd like to call it. And uh, Star Trek actually has the the three dimensional chess, so that's kind of cool. Um, I watched a scene on it and laughed, and I didn't hear the quote. And then I was like, "Well, what the heck? I I could have sworn this was going to be it." And then of course I typed in Star Trek Queen to Queens, and then I found the quote. The response is Queen to King Level One. You have restored my sight, plus 25,000 experience. I see an important prisoner in a castle on Mount Doom. He has your sight. Og curses as the idols vanish. Cool. That's kind of neat. That was a cool little quest there. All right, so he pushed us back up to Algary. And uh, I guess we can end the uh, episode right in front of uh, Algary. That's no problem. Thanks for watching. Next time. We're going to try and probably do all of the uh, building of gold and do all the necessary encounters in there maybe and see what there is to see, if anything. And then uh, probably we will head to the Ancient Wizard Lair just to finish up some quests for one of the lords, Lord Hacker, I think. And then we will head to Mount Doom. So thank you for watching. Bye-bye.